Hey there guys, Zach here from Winbeta and welcome to Microsoft Office 16. This is a pre-release in development version of Office which has been sent out to a select private group of users for testing. This build includes a couple of new features, nothing major such as the rumoured modern UI dedicated apps. This is directly for the desktop so um, you're not going to see any touch first UIs today. Today we're taking a look at the Word app in the Office 16 suite. Um, there's not a lot new in uh, this new in this early build. More things are coming later. So um, yeah, let's just jump straight in. The first new thing, which you may have already noticed, is the black theme. The black theme, which was last seen in Office 2010, is back in Office 16. It works like you would expect, and it works across the entire Office suite. It makes the UI darker. So as you can see, if we go along up here, everything is dark. And if we click on file, everything is dark here as well. Like I said, this works across the entire Office suite. So as you can see here, it is dark in Excel and it is dark in PowerPoint. Um, it's very nice on the eyes and for those who really wanted this feature, according to Microsoft, this was the most requested feature for return in the next version of Office. So um, they've listened and it's back in Office 16. Next up is the Tell Me search bar, which is located up here. This tell me search bar isn't actually new, it's already available in the Office web apps, however it's new to the desktop dedicated apps. The tell me search bar uh, pretty much allows you to search for commands that you don't know where to find within Word. So if I didn't know how to indent text, I just go up here and type in indent and there you have it, it'll give me the option to indent text. If I wanted to um, insert a picture, oh, insert picture, there you go insert picture from either online pictures or from file. And that's a good segue on to our next feature. In the new version of Word, and I believe in all the other apps as well, uh, Word will now look at the metadata that images spit out and automatically correct the orientation of the photo. Sadly, I can't get it working, maybe because my photos uh, don't spit out the correct metadata. However, if this was to work, the image would automatically rotate to the way it should have been taken. Also, I don't know if you noticed there, but there's a new sort of weird rotation rule regarding photos. So if I rotate the image, the image actually moves around the page like that, which I can't see to be very useful. However, well, it's there and that's how it works. So there you have it, guys. That's about it for the Word application within the Office 16 pre-release builds. Um, there's a lot of changes coming for Office and we haven't actually looked at the other apps today. We'll be taking a look at them very soon. So stay tuned at winbeta.org for more. Thanks so much for watching and I shall see you in the next one. Ta-ra!